hello is it me you're looking for i can see it in your eyes oh my god oh my god look at this traffic what's up everybody welcome to my channel it's an early monday morning and it's cold as hell but i've got it to grab seated seat i'm all good i just want to start off by saying thanks to everybody who did not unsubscribe from my channel in my time of absence uh, i was so bloody busy you know work 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 got to pay the bills but things have calmed down quite a lot now so Hopefully I can get back in to create some videos on a weekly basis and keep y'all entertained. So guys, I thought I'd do a video or a series of videos regarding one of the big questions a lot of people have on my bike. Um, and that is the fuel consumption. How's the fuel consumption on this Ducati Multistrada? And surprisingly enough, it is absolutely amazing. When I first thought of buying the bike, I was also thinking, shit, you know, it's a 1200cc, it's a massive bike, it's heavy. How is it going to be on fuel? And surprisingly enough, it, it really is amazing. Kudos to Ducati for this fuel management system they've done for this bike. It's it's truly remarkable. So, um, to kick it off, I'm going to do four videos, uh, four parts, with this being part one, um, the introduction, and then part two, I'll be taking you through the first running mode. I thought it would be a nice idea to do, not just do one overall test, but to do you four tests going through different running modes and also how I ride. So, for part two, I'm going to be doing touring mode because... I think touring mode is the most average riding mode because there's four riding modes, sport, touring, urban and um, enduro. So I'll start it off in, in touring mode and also I'll limit myself to only 4000 revs as well as not going over any speed limits, not over revving, you know, just keeping it chill and civil, you know. So that will be part two. And what I'll do is, so that you guys can see that I don't put in extra fuel or anything like that, I'll record my odometer at the start of every ride, um, and we can follow the process like that. Um, part 3 would be sport mode, or I like to call it hooligan mode, and that's where we'll really push it to the limits, um, high revving constantly, high speeds, um, and just, you know, having fun and going crazy, you know, like a lot of people do on their bikes. Uh, obviously keeping it as safe as possible and not breaking any laws, but to show you, or to give you an idea of what the consumption is under high pressure situations. So then lastly part 4, <clears throat> I would be doing enduro mode. So we'd go off road and we'll see how much fuel consumption, uh, what the fuel consumption is like off road. And how much fuel we can get, how much distance we can get for a certain amount of fuel. Obviously I'm not going to do it on a full tank because doing it on a full tank is absolutely insane I'll never be able to do that amount of distance off road in, in a couple of days just it'll take me a long time to do part 4 if I fill up my tank for enduro usually when I go do off riding I only put like 20 odd liters in the tank because it also not, not only takes away some weight but you know this bike's fuel management is flipping amazing. With 20 liters, <clears throat> you'd be amazed at what you can do. So, 
So yeah, that's it guys. That's my mini-series coming up. <clears throat> and um, let me know what you think. Please comment in the comments if you have any suggestions um, for any other or if you want to add stuff into the part or if, you want, if there's something you want me to do to add into the tests, I'll do it. I'm open to all suggestions <clears throat> and feedback as well. Feedback is, is crucial. Um, I'd like to know what you guys think of the videos from just wasting everybody's time or whatnot you know just let me know i will not be offended feedback's good um so yeah that's it for part one guys remember to subscribe um if you want to <coughs> be notified for the next parts coming up remember to hit the bell icon and please like the video and share it if possible i would really appreciate that so yeah, be safe and have an awesome week and I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.